All right, everybody, welcome. We are doing another compact video for the expected value of Dynasty, the newest set of Flesh and Blood. I'll try to, there is a bit of a mix up and I'll try to show to you as good as I can how it looks. Um, I'm gonna start with this original list because that's the one that I, I did this, it's a month ago now. Now, since I've checked prices a month ago, we can do this again. And I have checked all the single car prices and the ones I want to mention, prices went down again, not by much, but a bit. But there are some single cards going up and the ones where the prices are going up exceptionally more than the others are Skullcrack. It's uh, in, in foil. It's 8 euros instead of 6.50. That is card market low. I always compare card market lowest price. Uh, cleave 120 instead of uh, 60 cents. The foil one, oh, what is this? Number 90? That's Pulse Weave. Pulse Weave is at 21 bucks last month or on December 14th. It has been at 850. The normal version is at 12, it was at 720, so Pulse Weave is absolutely asked. Um, immobilizing shot well, went up 40 cents. Then we have what is this? Uh, 40 cents instead of 10, well, whatever. Um, we have the Sand Scour, Great Bow, went from 5 to 8. Perdition, Mask of Perdition in Cold Fall, friends. It went from 90 to 145, lowest price. That is quite a bit. Uh, I've, I've prepared the graph, you will see it in just a bit. The Fabled also went up from 290 to 350, maybe that's a thing to watch for. And then we have this Sandscar Marvel from 70 to 85. Celestial, five bucks up, and the Nitro in, uh, this, the Marvel Nitro from 132 to 189. So, it all comes down to this. Um, this is how it looks. These are the expensive cards. That's the uh, that's the fabled, the Command and Conquer. Well, it's more expensive than the last months. Maybe that's just an exception, but who knows? Um, the legendary cold foils, on average, are down two bucks. The legendary rainbow foils are down two bucks. That's compared to last month. And these are the exact. Uh, these are precise numbers. Right, um, the other one I have is the uh, the Marvels. That's down two bucks, the, the expensive Marvels. And the other ones, I've had to research from some pull rates. I also made Uprising EV. I'm gonna do this video in a bit. Today it's the 8th, uh, 11th. Maybe I'm just gonna upload this Ma Dynasty EV right now. And whenever I get the chance to do the uh, Uprising, that's the last expected value of set I'm gonna have to do and then I'm going to update all these sets every once in a while. Anyways, these marvels went up in price. Uh, basically, yeah, the only one that went up except for this Fabled. And then the Majestic Cold Foil, this is because of, well, because of the Mask of Perdition, right? Majestic Cold Foil, yeah. Uh, the Extended Arts went down another euro and then I have another short overview about the uh, Majestics. Majestics, Majestic Foil Heroes went down two bucks. The uh, Majestic Foil Equipment went down just a bit. The Majestic Foils are almost stable, just slightly down. We have the uh, Majestic Equipment, that's the light, the orange, light orange, almost yellow, went down just a bit and uh, the normal majestics exactly the same is that true did i i think i've had a mix up right there that's the thing yeah on average yeah all right now this is this is the expected value that's what you are here for i have taken my pull rates as usual i have taken the price that i have calculated this month let's call it yeah this month um Marvel Cold Falls went up, the Majestic Marvels, and the Majestic Cold Falls also went up. So, if you are listening to this, maybe 
you didn't understand anything. If you're watching this, I hope you understood everything. This is the price for a case. This is the price for a case minus 5% fee if you sell the single cards. This is the expected value for one display for this for this week right now. 58 bucks. Also, um, the normal commons I didn't count. The normal rares I didn't count because they're just there is really nothing of worth. The rainbow foils I also I put up zero here. And then you get one euro of value from the common cold foils. You get um, a little more than one euro of value from the rare rainbow foil equipment. But you know that's almost nothing. The, uh, the average rainbow foil equipment is thirty five cents now, and yeah. The average common coal foil is 557. Is that correct? Yes, it is. Indeed. That's the average price. That is the pull rate. Yeah. So that's basically it. It's, it's one euro less than last month. So it's it was fast degrading. Now it is slowly, slowly finding its price. What I found uh, interesting is this right here. The, the the lowest price for a booster box is 77 delivered to my door i mean if, of course if you if you divide shipping for several boxes well you might get one for 75 but yeah the prices are going slightly up to be honest this is interesting we have the progress uh, season 3 coming up so that means on january 14th um yeah you can do all these pro quests and qualify for the big tournament in Belgium. Is that right? And yeah, that's why I have been very, very busy in the last time because I have shipped out so many orders like never before. And I'm, I'm going to continue this right now. That's the expected value for this month. We have a quick update. I hope you're having yourself a good time and I'll talk to you into the next video. I have several more coming up. Hey, until then, bye-bye.